Why haven't we thought of this before? This panel proposes a way you could use to supposedly deliver punches stronger than anyone else, making you the new world champion. I assume most of you know what a finger flick is. It's when you hold your middle finger with your thumb and start pushing the middle finger while maintaining hold, and then in a moment release it to unleash a strong flick otherwise impossible if not for this technique. This panel wants us to do the same principle with both our hands to make the most powerful punch. While it does doesn't work, it's very interesting, and it reminds me of a very interesting fellow, the mantis shrimp. It punches at a staggering 80 kilometers per hour, with a force of roughly 150 kilograms, which is almost equal to a 22 caliber bullet. If you scale it to human size, it's about 700 tons. Even elephants couldn't survive such a punch, and if it's this strong underwater with all the resistance, imagine how destructive would it be if unleashed in open air. Actually, a mantis shrimp holds back its punches when in air. Perhaps it realizes that its punches are too powerful, and unleashing one on air might literally burst its arms. Their punch is so powerful it results in cavitation bubbles, water vaporizing due to extreme speed. These bubbles collapse with a faint flash of light, and generate temperatures as high as 4400 degrees Celsius in the surrounding water. That's nearly as hot as the surface of the sun. In order to break tough clams and defend itself, the mantis shrimp uses its hammer-like claws, employing what they call a click mechanism. Here's how it works. A large muscle slowly contracts while a latch holds everything in place, storing potential energy, and in a moment, the latch is released, resulting in the fastest strike in the animal kingdom. This might be an oversimplification, but this mechanism is kind of similar to a finger flick. So, why can't you replicate it with punches? I don't know, give it a shot. I mean, even if you did it, the impact would destroy your hand. Because unlike the mantis, your limbs are not so hard, and you can't molt and grow new flesh every three months. The truth is, the mantis shrimp evolved specifically for this feat. Its body, muscles, and reflexes all work in perfect harmony to execute this marvel of nature.